when we talk about snowpack, we're talking about the snow that's been gradually accumulating in the mountains near the headwaters of our major river systems. The water in that snow would ideally melt off slowly during the spring months so we have water in our reservoirs for summer. It also alleviates wildfire danger. But at this point, there are three concerning issues with our snowpack. For one, it appears the snowpack peaked almost a week early. April 7th is the average date for snowpack to reach its peak and start the runoff season. The data shows it reached its highest point around April 1st. Usually the earlier it peaks, the earlier it melts. The second concern is the amount of snowpack. At its peak on April 1st, statewide snowpack was 6% below average. Last year, it was 7% above average. That's 13% less snow this season. And the third concern is how fast it's already melting. The snowpack is now down to 20% below average just seven days after peaking. It didn't get down this low last year until the final week of April. There is some good news though coming next week. Long range computer models are showing a cooler and wetter signal. That could slow the rate of melt and add 15 to 20 inches of new snow. That wouldn't be enough to get back up to peak levels, but it might be enough to prevent a record fast runoff. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, 9 News.